These basketballers had converged in Lagos for a national competition which commenced in April but has now come to a close. It was interesting to see students, top sport personalities and other dignitaries watch the final game of the competition. The game had all the elements of a top class encounter. They were slam dunks. And slick moves all executed by this young talented basketballers. The Kili contest final between Government Secondary School Mina and Government Secondary School Abuja ended 65 to 60 points in favor of the Mina boys. Organizers of the competition are convinced that tournaments like this are good platforms for discovering and cultivating dreams. So I can, I believe we can continue it for years to come. You know, it's, it's just amazing to be part of this and we're very proud of it. Look, already we're doing a lot of things, I believe, you know, already the quality of the game is the most important part. And I think we are including more and more uh, schools. If I'm correct, I think last time we had 18,000 uh, students uh, with us. So I think just being able to get as many uh, students as possible, to get as many, uh, not only boys, but girls as well participating is the ultimate objective. Wow, it's been, it's, it's been a thrilling superlative event. Um, this is taking the game one notch higher this year. Uh, I think everyone here has uh, made the same comments. Beautiful game, beautiful event, well organized. In fact, if you have not been here and you have not watched online, you've missed a very big thing. Look, look, much more than the cash prizes, the Milo supplies and the very many gifts that we give to the children. But it's more important for us is the opportunity to play on a platform like this. When you get involved in sports, you learn so many values. Confidence, discipline, teamwork, friendship, respect. All of these values help you to succeed in life. This is one side of the story. But on the other side, we also have what we call the Milo Top 50 Camp, where we bring the very best of this children together and they are they play and are coached by the best of the NBA and they get the opportunity to be scouted away. This is the kind of opportunity that we give to the children. Also on hand to speak on the competition is a key leader of the Nigerian Basketball Federation. Uh, I know the NBA is not showing up but this is the new NBA. 
and uh, the bedrock of all the programs for NABF is hinged on grassroots programs. So it behoves us to show ourselves here. And uh, it's a shame that the president cannot be here. He's uh, currently out of town. And uh, the, board members, uh, the, the board members also, uh, some of them left town a couple of days ago. So uh, I'm standing in for the president as the VP. And I'm also here on behalf of, uh, of myself. The girls category of the competition saw St. Jude Girls Secondary School Bayasa edged out Yejide Girls Secondary School Oil by 41 to 14 points with Grace John winning the Most Valuable Player Award. Francisca Obudu, DBN Sports Lagos.